Hey guys, I got another Ranger. I still have my 86, but okay, the plan was originally I was gonna buy this one. It's a 92 Ranger with a 2.9 liter automatic. I was gonna use this one for parts for my 86, but after I got it, I only paid a couple hundred bucks for it. I drove it around the block, and I mean, it rides and drives better than my 86. It's got a spoiler thing on there, or not spoiler, lower air dam. That's probably going to be taken off, 3D thing. It's got um, some kind of aftermarket side mirrors on it. I'm not sure who the hell thought to put step bars in a two-wheel drive truck. It's got a Lund visor on it, I like that. 14 inch rims, they could use some polishing, but not crazy about the flatbed, but you know, I could drive it like that until I find a regular bed for it, then sell that one to some. Well, I have a friend who is interested in it. It's got the other tires, so I'm actually not sure why he has the steelies on. Oh well. It's got, it's not paneling, it's like individual slats. It's kind of like that flooring that links together. Kind of like a puzzle, I guess. But that would probably be coming off. Maybe he didn't do a bad job on it, but... El Cheapo Roadmaster speakers. Inside it's got... What are they? Tuner FX? I've never heard of them, but... It's got like these little aluminum blocks. Holding it in. And I mean, it, it's not going anywhere. Oh, I mean, you really hugged in these things. It's also got a moon roof, or sunroof, whatever you want to call it. I don't really, is there a difference? I mean, I don't know, but. I like that's a neat feature to me. It's made by SFC, I'm not sure what it stands for. But I don't think Ford ever had that from factor I think that's like a dealer option but yeah it's like I said automatic but it only has uh, just 89,000 yeah 88,000 almost 89,000 miles on it it hasn't been, ins been inspected for a while he said sometimes it will start and sometimes it'll just crank he said he, it's like it's not getting fuel. He replaced the entire fuel pump and in tank, everything in, in the tank. I'm thinking it's probably a, uh, what is it, relay. The fuel pump relay is probably has a crappy connection or something. Yeah, it's stuck right now, big deal. Game book. Ranger book, I already have one, but now I got another. I don't know why the seats are mismatched. They're not the seats, the seat belt. I had to explore a short console when I, when I went to look at it, and then when he dropped it over from my house, it's gone. Yeah, that line's still there from it. So that kind of pissed me off. Sneaky bastard. What the hell's in here? Rubber for something. Bolts for something. And. Installation for an LED mirror. That don't look like no LED mirror to me. But there is a crack. It ends right there. Let's hope it doesn't spread anymore. Because if it's just there, I can still get inspected enough to replace my windshield. Hopefully I don't get hit any big bumps on the way over. <laughs> I mean, not that he wouldn't inspect it anyway. Inside it's kind of neat. It's shiny red. Yes, these seats. Yeah, they do. They do fold forward. Look at that. More Roadmaster goodness. I think they're all hooked up too. Get my keys. 
I don't know if the guy who had it before me was like a redneck or not. Shine. Yeah. Okay, not that shit. Just be the 98 caller in to 98 Rock. And no nab two day general admission tickets to see. Sounds like they all work. Oh, that hits the windshield. Or the, the back window. Better be careful there. And I don't just say that because okay. Well, that's that. Oh. Now for the motor. Basic 2.9. I wonder if the air works. Haven't tried it yet. I've only driven around the block once. Looks like a newer water pump in there. Belts look fairly new. Battery's a little too big for the spot there, but we'll do something about that. Yep. Oh, there's the motor. Ooh, ah, ooh. For underneath, it doesn't have that much clearance there. But he added uh, three inch blocks and air shocks to clear that. You think a smart guy would have just uh, spaced the flatbed up a little higher, but whatever. It's just a stock muffler and stock piping right now, but that is gonna change, guarantee it. I'd probably take the duels off my 86 and put it on it. Cute little 7.5. Still got the spare tire. These are just my stock high beams and stuff from the 86 when I lowered it. So, yep. That's about it for now. Till then.